This is the best pasta I've ever made. It's quick and cheap. If you like it, please comment, I love pasta. And don't forget to like this video. Start by cutting 500 grams of hot dog sausage. Cut each one crosswise into four equal sized pieces. I'm using chicken sausages, but you can use any other type you like. Have you heard of that recipe app? It's already available for Android and iOS. Scroll down to the comment section and download it right now. Once you've chopped these sausages, set them aside. To a medium bowl, add two whole eggs. Then add one teaspoon of salt, a generous pinch of black pepper, and one teaspoon of sweet paprika. Using a whisk or fork, mix it all together very well until ingredients combine. The ingredients and directions to this recipe will be detailed in the comment section below, step by step. When that happens, add 200 milliliters of water and 200 milliliters of milk. Mix it all together very well again for another minute. Leave us a comment with the name of the city from which you're watching this. I'd like to give you a shout out and thank you for sharing this recipe. This is the right consistency. You may now stop mixing it and set aside. To a round shape baking tray, add a drizzle of olive oil. Using a brush, spread this olive oil all over the baking tray. I'm using a 25 centimeter diameter baking tray. Then add 300 grams of penne pasta to this baking tray. Using a spatula or spoon, mix this pasta until olive oil is evenly spread all over it. Have you downloaded that recipe app on your phone yet? It's already available for download. I'll leave the app link for download here in the comments section. Go ahead and download it right now. After that, sprinkle some fresh parsley to taste all over this pasta. Also add one half red bell pepper chopped into dices and one medium tomato also chopped into dices. Now add all those sausage pieces we've chopped, evenly spreading them all over the baking tray, just like I'm doing here. Finally, pour all that cream we've just prepared. Now cover this baking tray with some aluminum foil. If you've made it here, that means you're enjoying our recipe. So click the share button and share this video with all your friends. It won't cost you anything, but for us, it will make all the difference. Take it to a preheated oven at 180 degrees Celsius or 356 degrees Fahrenheit for 40 minutes. After this indicated time, pasta will have cooked through. Remove the aluminum foil and add 200 grams of shredded mozzarella cheese all over it. Take it to a preheated oven at 180 degrees Celsius or 356 degrees Fahrenheit for another 10 minutes or until cheese has slightly browned on top. To finish it off, sprinkle some fresh parsley to taste. That recipe is ready. You may now get some and enjoy it. I really hope you like this recipe. Now I'll head back to the comments section and we'll continue to answer everyone who left the name of their city. And I'll also thank you for sharing this recipe. See you next recipe. Bye.